Hello, 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 peeps. Welcome, welcome, welcome. What the hell is that? Oh, that's an orange. Um, yes, yes, to Silent Hill, Brookhaven Hospital, part three. We are in the hill. As you can see, we're in the crazy bit of the hospital. We've already done one bit of the key. If you've been following our YouTube guides as well, uh, last one released, part two for the Brookhaven Hospital on Friday. So go check it out on YouTube, peeps. Also, sorry we weren't streaming on Thursday. We had a household full of ill people. So, yeah. Um, but today, it's just a guide uh, to hopefully complete the Brookhaven Hospital in this stream. Hopefully. Um, and then all the secrets, hints and tips that we come across. Do any boss fights along the way. Hope you enjoy the stream. Drop a like, comment. Hit that notification bell as well if watching on YouTube. Love the support, peeps. It helps us a lot. So thank you. So enjoy. Now, one of the things with Silent Hill, you can do the game. If you've got the puzzle codes and stuff, some people don't like it, but if you do have the puzzle codes to hand and things, or if it's a new game plus, um, codes stay the same. So you can skip massive sections of the game, um, which can really help. Oh, we've got a memory here, I believe. There we go. Can't break it. And obviously as well, we showed our little tip as well on how to take out enemies. I mean, we've got to this point here. This is hard mode, hard puzzles. We got to a point where we were on plus 100 uh, bullets as well. So we have lost quite a lot of bullets. Six pills, as you do. Watch it go dark. Okay. One year they've been watching me. So many pills they fed me. When a loud hour comes, one tremble every time the light falls. I don't know why my head's going sideways there. So that's six, one, I would assume. This must be the code for one of the keypads. All right, here we, ooh, there we go, bend out. What the hell is that? Whoa, whoa. Get in through there. Oh, hello. Can I hit him through the wall? Oh, yes. Lovely. Oh, I love this. Ah, uh, then. Okay. Well, sounds like there's two. Mm. 
There is two. I want you to move. There we go. Remember, always aim for the legs, peeps. Right, she's over there. Oh, it's one of you. Out there. <laughs> in there's sign in there, I can hear it. Have we gone in there? There will two. Yeah, we haven't had a chance to get onto that side. How come we never went into C1? Ah, I knew there was a nurse in there. Oi, 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 oi. How the hell did you get through? How? What? You cheat. Have it, have it. you get through that? <sighs> wow! Have a drink, James. How did he... What the hell? How did she walk through that? But there you go. The key for there. Oh, hello. Shotgun shells. Oh, no, it's handgun. Oh, got excited. I right, can move that out of the way now. It's all to do with these chains, but why is that there? Hmm. Okay. So we can drag that. Ah, there we go. To get into L3, everyone. There we go.
So remember as well, always look out for the little white towels fabric and stuff. It gives you a hand telling you exactly where you need to put stuff right there. So there's plainly going to be sand in there. So the two codes, one's got four. Okay, that's going to be fun to work out. There we go, nice little save. Hello, James. Jesus Christ, let's go again. All right, do you reckon I could... I think so. And there you go, that's how you get in there and smash them to pieces without, without even taking a goddamn bit of damage. Alright, so we've done that, done that, done that. Always check every nook and cranny. He's there again, looking, staring, he says he'll drag me there. I don't want to. I won't let him take me. I'm only fighting you. There you go. Give me those bullets, please. The director's office. Where? The hell? Oh. How to get there? All right, straight round the corner. Director's office is this way. Hello, meow meow. You okay? Come to join us to play Silent Hill. There'll be no pain anymore. Oh, good. There'll be no pain anymore. Look. These are those bits where I wish I went back and saved. Oh God, I don't like that at all.
Oh, it's saving. It's auto saving. I don't like that. It's giving us a syringe. I found Nort Nort 50 in the ECT room again. This time I checked, he was not appointed for the treatment. How is it possible he got there all by himself? And how would he know to turn the thing on? Somebody's going to answer for this. So close, it will happen. Has to. Oh, okay. Mate, this is giving me all the Hallmark vibes of a boss fight. Hello, love. But I could have sm Ah, come on. Ah, oh, crap. Get through that gap. There we go, James. Hello, love. Sneak through. This is a little cheat. I've learned. I would say a cheat, but he's obviously to Oh my god, Rip. Oh my god! There's me telling you all about this little cheat. We got spanked. No word of a lie, that might have been done in a patch. And they've never come through there before for me. So I don't know if that was fixed in a patch, but man, I used to love doing that to them. They just couldn't get you. Oh, can't see. Oh, there's another one! Jeez! There's two... Is there three nurses there? Right. Third time's the charm. Could be the fourth. I think it's in Silent Hill, I like to play as uh, loose <laughs> with the weapons. I don't really try to use my bullets. Come on! 
Have a drink, James. Right, they're over there. What the heck? Mate, this bit's getting crazy. This bit's getting a bit silly. Ah, Silent Hill! And everyone's going, why don't you use your bloody hand gun? It's hard to save my bullets, I've only got 41. There's a bloody boss coming, trust me. I feel it. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'll take it back, girls, I'll take it back. I swear to God, I'm sorry. Okay, so you can just run past the nurses on that one. Jesus Christ. Trick him up, run for your life. Best way. Alright, full energy. Yes, it's been so long. Hit the Jenny. Anything can any sinks, look in the toilets for any, you know, health. I won't rest until they're sober, they won't rest. I can't rest, I don't know anymore. As you do. Wow, that scared the crap out of me. Ooh. Three six five nine. Oh, nine six five nine. Nine six five nine. Okay. Nine six five. Oh, we didn't put it on the map. Nice. That must be one of the codes for the boxes. There you go. Right. <laughs> Oh, we can just cut through it then, okay. I wonder what that bit's for. Who knows? Anyway, 9659. Alright, how many people we got watching today? All right, so the 9659 is for the right code. Yeah. All right, so we had six pills, one struck of the bell. All right, let's try that. One struck of the bell, six pills. There was a two on that photo. So just run through this and see if it clicks on anything. So 
Sometimes that's the thing I like about Silent Hill. You can just do little jiggy bits like that. Oh, it's a box. There we go. We've got an elevator button, as you do. She is an angel, no one knows only. I can see the lady of Adobe cannot walk along her bridge of thread. They fall from the weight of their crimes, like bloated and ugly corpses. But since she devours them, sin and sin over like she saves me. She is an angel. Here we go. Where the hell are we going? To the elevator! the hell's the elevator? Alright, so we've all come back for the lady of the door and put a ring on her finger. Oh, the lift's right here. <laughs> Didn't say, didn't say, didn't say! Thanks for tuning in! Welcome to another exciting edition of Trick or Treat, where you answer our questions correctly and win a prize beyond your wildest dreams. Or, you fail to answer correctly and receive the punishment. It's all in the hands of our lucky contestant, James Sunderland! James! Are you ready to play trick or treat? Excellent! Here's your first question. Let's go! In the early 1800s, a terrible disease spread across Silent Hill, resulting in the death of many of its inhabitants. Their bodies thrown into the lake to sleep forever in their watery grave. How many souls were lost during the plague? One, forty-two, two, 67, 3, 85. Know the answer? Well, you better hold on to it. You never know when it might come in handy. Now, on to the second question. Follow Sanders Street heading east and further on to the outskirts of town. One and only one road will take you towards the lumber yard and the cemetery. What is the name of that road? One. Bachman Road. Two, Munson Street. Three, Wiltsey Road. Did you get that? I sure as hell hope so. And for a third and final question, Silent Hill witnessed a gruesome murder a few years back. A brother and sister were playing in the road when they were attacked and chopped in the pieces with an axe. Torn flesh. Smashed bones, splattered blood. What a terrible tragedy. What a gruesome end to such innocent lives. One of the victims was a local boy named Billy Loke. But 
What was the name of the other victim? Billy's sister. One, Miriam. Two, Heather. Three, Julia. Well, that's the last of our questions. Have you got it all figured out? If so, fantastic. The time will soon come to collect your prizes. But be careful. If you're wrong, well, looks like that's all the time we have for today, folks. Thanks for tuning in. See you somewhere, sometime, in sickness or in health. Bye. What the hell was that? Okay, so it looks like we don't need... I can hear something. Those puzzle clues yet. I know one's Heather. I would... Yeah, the kid is Heather, because she's from Silent Hill 3. Take the knife ones. Just don't have time for that. Tell you what, if you can avoid an enemy in this, do so. <laughs> Sorry, it's just the cats were jumping in the sink. I feel like I need to go this way where the nurse is because that's going to be like a dead end place around here. <laughs> yeah, kitchen disposal. There she is. Right, is it a knife one? Holy crap! Ahoy! Ahoy hoy! Cheeky little <laughs> mannequin! Dodge! Squeezy! Coming through! Oh god, she's quick. Excuse me. Ah! Whoa! Oh, it's -a me, Mario! I didn't find anything in there, didn't set anything off. Right, what's my shotgun saying? Okay, we've got a good few rounds of the shotgun. Hmm. 
I see you. All right, so we've got a cheeky one there. The hell. Is that how? Is that fair? So unfair. So unfair. She just stood back and just shot him in the leg. Well, we learn. I mean, these things, I'll kill them all day. Just to give it a second so that the dreaded juice disappears. Because you can get hurt by that stuff and it's not worth it. So avoid it if you can, peeps. And I don't know normal if you actually get anything from all these drawers because there's so many places I've opened up and I haven't got anything from. genuinely hate the knife ones. They're so much quicker. And hopefully I can trick her. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm here. Come get me. Oh crap. Right, come through this gap. I want you to come through this gap. There we go. Alright, see you later. have to look in every little corner in this game oh got a ring hey maria what's going on mary oh maria i thought i mean i knew it was maria man james Sorry. you just got hardcore there so anyway i'm glad you're alive anyway what do you mean anyway i was almost killed back there i have never been so scared in my whole life all you care about is that dead wife of yours. You couldn't care less about me, could you? No, I just... Have and stay with me. Don't leave me alone again. You're supposed to take care of me. I... So what about Laura? You found her? 
Yeah, but she ran away. What? Well, we have to find her. Yeah, you, uh... You really seem to care about that girl. Do you know her? I... I've never met her before. I just feel sorry for her. She's all alone and... I don't know, for some reason I feel like it's up to me to protect her. Come on, let's go look for her. All right, so we've got Maria back. So, so Maria's back. I don't know if that's a good thing. Because now I've got blooming someone to look after. Oh, there's bullets there, and I want them. I want those bullets. Where the hell do I get those bullets? God damn it. Juicy handgun ammo I left there. That's the bit where I was fighting. Yeah, the nurse. Oh, that's unfortunate. Three bullets. Where are we? First floor. Can't go upstairs anymore. Syringe? The place is falling apart and you're cracking jokes. Go on, girl. Ooh. It's a very terrifying looking uh, swimming pool. Ooh, they mustn't know. Let's flip it. Got a code. Looks like a 7 3. I'm hearing the craziest noises coming through my headset, it's scaring the crap out of me. <laughs> is that what I think it is? Uh, 
Having trouble there? Yeah. You think you could give me a hand? Me? You're supposed to be the big man around here. How's a little girl like me supposed to help? <laughs> oh, fine. Already got one. Hmm. Thanks. So, where to now? Oh. No. Ah. Come on. I think I know where those rings belong. Um, my book got there. Let's have a little read. The patients will become a diagnosis scheduled for them when they'll make recoveries. My aim is always for the entire personnel, especially when their symptoms become receding uh, with effective treatment. Thank you very much. Yeah, measuring your dog. Well, that's the decorative box done. Remember, this is hard mode, so it's two, three, one for the code for the decorative box in the pharmacy. Um, so we've done that, we've done that, we've done that. That goes to the pool, takes you through there. Locker room, la 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 la. We, I don't know why I put that away. What we need to do is get to floor two. You know, I'm gonna save it after that box because I ain't risking it. It's a good few shotgun shells, two syringes, which will be incredibly helpful. Sorry, Maria. Blast you right in the face there. Is that better? She just got dragged into the elevator just then. What's wrong? I thought you wanted to get out of here. 
I know. It's just... Something doesn't feel right. Come on. Trust me. It's not exactly like Aladdin and Jasmine. That's terrifying. Make the music sounds amazing. It is done. Sick no more. Uh, is this when he done it? If you haven't played, obviously the first, uh, you know, this is the remake and stuff like that. But if you haven't played the other game before, I won't spoil it. As to what it's all about, what James is seeing, sensing, reading and what Silent Hill represents. I don't know. Shall I spoil it? Shall I not? I don't know. Do people know? Do, does, is there, are there people out there that don't know? But this game is a massive journey that James is taking. Oh god, it's Pyramid Head! Alert, Maria! Ah! Oh crap! Jesus! James, how did you get ahead of her? Come on, hurry! Oh, you just dropped her on the floor, bro. Go on, Maria, you can get through. down again James
Laura. The potential for this illness exists in all people, and under the right circumstances, any man or woman would be driven like him to the other side. The other side, perhaps, may not be the best way to phrase it. After all, there is no wall between here and there. It lies on the borders where reality and unreality intersect. It is a place both close and distant. Some say it, either, it isn't even an illness. I cannot agree with it. I'm a doctor, not a philosopher, or even a psychiatrist, unlike the director. But sometimes I have to ask myself this question. It's true that to us, his imaginings are nothing but the inventions of a busy mind. But to him, there simply is no other reality. Furthermore, he is happy there. So uh, why? I ask myself, why in the name of healing him must we drag him painfully into the world of our own reality? Man, that was deep. It's saying that's the security room. Can we get to the security room? Can we jump in? No, there's nothing in the security room. All right. Bye bye, Brookhaven Hospital. And bye bye, Maria. There we got a few bullets. Back on the streets of Silent Hill. the gas clouds night no come on Sometimes you've got to draw the girls out, you know? Like, come on! I know you can see me! I've got plenty of space! I swear there was three things there, but oh, we're gonna check. Now we collected it all. That's good. All right, seven. Oh, good. We got some health, peeps. We've got some health. That's good. I like that. I always try and kill the bugs as well if I see them, because just to stop the radio from going off as well. That cheap.
Okay, we're building up the ammunition again, which is good, or it's like that. Damn on you. Now you got some speed on your love. Ah. <laughs> Jesus Christ, James. Mate, she's on it. Mate, she's gonna get close to slapping me in a second. Better move. Oh, oh, Jesus, dodged. Jeez, mate, calm. Mate, she's bang on it. Alright. Alright, let's kill this little bug. He's annoying me, right? Come on, girl! Come down here, come! You obviously want to eat my face. Come, 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 come. We're gonna give it some proper distance. I'm gonna trap you here so you just stay on this side of the bloody door. Come on, you chief. Go, 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 go. Hopefully I can leave her behind. That's the plan anyway. God damn it, there's another one there. I ain't losing to you. I am not losing to you. You know what? I'm going to have a syringe. I'm going to have a syringe because I've got a couple. But Jesus Christ. But just give it a break. Give it a break. So I like to check out what's in every corner of the map. This is why I do this. And gets a bit stressful sometimes. <laughs> no break them for some reason. dead oh. 
God damn you all! Alright, so you get some shotgun shells and some handgun. That's not too bad, I'll take that. Hey, bubble. Alright, so we've got her over there, so we've got to run through here. Has she clocked me? I must admit, I was very confident at the start of this game, but as I've got to this point here, I'm a bit scared of the enemies now, because Jesus Christ. How fair, how fair. <laughs> Me raging out, how fair. Oh, a syringe. Thank God. I like to have at least two syringes for the bosses. Laura, stop! It's dangerous!
Hard mode certainly is hard. Those ones are always a couple of hits, two hits at least, and then down, and then back off, back off. I need that. Drink that health drink. Check the car for bullets. This is why you got to check every nook and cranny, just in case, just for bullets and stuff, health potions, potions, health drinks. As you can see, I've got quite a few. <laughs> Been saving them up. James is a vandal. There we go, see? Always pick up something here or there. Got quite a few bullets, which is nice. You never generally find anything in the middle of the maps or the roads in the Silent Hill. It's always Laura, please, in the please. corners and stuff like that. You know? It's always stick to the corners in Silent Hill. Syringe. Nice. 
and remember check where James is looking as well because he will tell you if there's anything there by looking over to it here we are people we're coming to the end of this video I hope you enjoyed and liked it please drop us a like a comment and subscribe if you haven't already and hit up that notification bell to make sure you don't miss out on any more content this is it we've finished Brookhaven and now we are on our way to Toluca prison check us out next episode will be on Sunday 10 a.m. British Standard Time and it will be part one to the Toluca prison Thanks again for joining us, everyone, and Josh Quarty Army. Whoa, Take care, peeps. Turk out. Peace.